what up y'all so i just got done playing in makeup i was literally just trying stuff on trying on the new fenty liners and the new fenty lipsticks this video is in partnership with sephora inside jc penny i really quickly wanted to show you guys my nighttime routine because i feel like i haven't done one of those in a while as far as like taking off my makeup and showing you guys that process um starting from like a full face just gonna pull my hair up Okay. Um, first, we're gonna remove the makeup. I wanted to share with you guys a new product that I've been loving. Um, and this one is by my favorite, one of my favorite skincare brands of all time. You guys know I love Drunk Elephant. And they have a new makeup remover. So this is the Slay Makeup Melting Butter Cleanser. This is an amazing makeup remover. I love it. Um, if you guys know me, you know that I love to remove my makeup using balms and creams and things of that sort because I do not like the way makeup wipes make my skin feel. I don't know. I feel like the texture increases when I use a makeup wipe. So I'm going to be using this makeup cleansing balm. It comes with this cute little um, magnetic spoon on top. So it sticks to the top. I hate when products come with spoons and scoopers and stuff, but there's nowhere to put it. I'm like, where am I supposed to put this? Like, how am I supposed to store this? As you can see, I love this product. I've been using it for about two months now, a month and a half, two months. I'm almost at the bottom. So we're just gonna take a little bit. A little goes a long way. Scoop this off onto my hand. Put the top back on. Work the magic into our fingers and then start massaging that on our face. I like that this removes my mascara very easily. No tugging, no pulling. Keeps the elasticity of my skin intact without being abrasive, rough, or harsh. I'm gonna go rinse my face and I'll be right back. We're gonna go ahead and use our face wash now. I love this little kit that I got from Sephora inside JCPenney. Look at this little bag, isn't it cute? And it is the Littles kit. And this kit has all of Drunk Elephant's popular skincare products inside, um, but they're all little mini versions. Um, this is perfect for on the go, if you like to travel, or if you wanna take it to the gym with you or something like that. Um, but there's like little tiny products in here. Also, if you are interested in trying out Drunk Elephant products, but you don't wanna spend the full amount. For example, the C-Firma serum is like 80 or 90 bucks on its own in a full size. But if you get this whole kit, it's $90 for the whole thing. So you can try out all the products if you're interested in trying to figure out what your regimen will be. Get a feel for it and see what you like. It's also a great little gift. So if you're ever in the giving mood. So I'm actually going to use their face wash in here. This is the Bestie Jelly Cleanser. It's a very gentle cleanser. I typically don't need a deep clean after I use something like a makeup melting cleanser. I mean, it pretty much gives me a initial cleanse so that I don't have to deep clean my makeup out of my skin. Pretty much lifted everything out of there so that I don't have to go back and do that um, with a deep cleaning, oil stripping, skin drying face wash. That is why I'm using this one. It's very, very gentle. It's very softening and it leaves my skin feeling good, not irritated, not dry. Face is rinsed. I'm gonna dab my face clean. After washing my face, I'm gonna go in with my serums, potions, magic. You know, all the good stuff. The stuff that I need to make sure that my skin is retexturizing and refining overnight because that's when your skin does its dirty work when you're sleeping. That's why you should get sleep. Okay, it's one of my favorite AJ serums. This is the Glycolic Night Serum TLC. I probably used up maybe four containers of it. Um, I am going to use the serum, but I'm also going to mix it with a little bit of the Hydra Intensive Hydration Serum because that is the one that helps with hydration. And um, I do like for my skin to be hydrated, especially after doing all of the cleansing I just did. Even though they don't leave my skin feeling dry at all, I still like to make sure that my skin is nice and hydrated when I go to sleep. One squirt of that TLC and then one squirt of the Hydra, And I'm just going to put that on my skin. 
And then for this bottom part here, because I do want to make sure that my skin is taken care of in that area since I am getting laser hair removal treatments, I want to make sure that it is moisturized and hydrated, that it's not dry or anything or irritated. Um, for irritation and for really dry skin, I would recommend the Virgin Marula face oil. I love this face oil. It's um, highly recommended that you use it if you are using any of the, uh, I call it serums or any serum that is going to make your skin more sensitive. So um, I also recommend using the face oil and patting that on your eyebrows and your eyelashes because that helps with conditioning them and helping them grow. And then last but not least, I am going to use the Laneige Sleeping Mask. This is a fave of mine as well. Can also be found at Sephora inside JCPenney. Gonna take a little bit on my fingernail and use that to moisturize my lips overnight so that we have nice smooth lips when we wake up. In the morning, I will come back and I will show you guys what I do to take care of my skin for the day. Good morning. So this is my face when I wake up. We have to make sure that our skin is protected in the morning. Do we not? First in the morning, I like to just get the crust out of my eyes and wet my face. So I'm just gonna wet my face first and then dry that off. We're going to take our Drunk Elephant Littles again. They are wonderful for mixing, so you can mix two different products to get the desired effect that you need. So I'm going to be mixing the Bee Hydra Hydration Serum, and I'm also going to be using the C Firma, which is the Vitamin C Serum. And I mix these two to give me a little Vitamin C Hydration Concoction. One pump of the Bee Hydra, one pump of the vitamin C serum. So because this vitamin C serum is very potent, you want to make sure that you protect your skin as well. I also have been doing um, laser hair removal on this part of my face. So this part of my face is more sensitive to the sun as well. So in order to prevent that from having any issues and also to prevent my dark spots from getting darker and things like that after using the glycolic night serum last night, um, I definitely need to make sure that I use a sunscreen. And the sunscreen that I really, really like is the Unseen Sunscreen, which is by Supergoop. I love their sunscreen in particular because it is perfect for my skin tone. Oil-free, it's lightweight, it's colorless. It helps to um, minimize the appearance of pores. So that's perfect for me because in the summertime, I tend to be a bit more oily. I usually use the Super Screen by Supergoop, but that one is a more hydrating formula and I use that more for fall winter time. This one's perfect for the summer because it does give me that poreless look. So it doesn't give me any shine, but it also leaves a little bit of that glow. It's a wonderful base for makeup and that's why I really like this one. I feel like my makeup goes on a lot smoother and it doesn't get oily throughout the day. And that is it for my morning routine. That's all I do. Um, I just need the protection and the hydration and all of that and then we're good to go. So that's all. If you have any questions, please let me know. All the information you need will be in the description box, in the caption or thing like that so you guys can check out all of the links to all the products that I mentioned that are all from Sephora inside JCPenney and you guys can check them out for yourselves all right peace